Mm. That's incredible. It's like lemonade. Hey, Squints. Our taste buds help us know what kinds of chemicals we are putting in our body. That's a good thing, but it's also kind of normal. Here are five ways to hack your taste buds or trick your brain into thinking you're eating something that you're not. This first one may not seem all that exciting, but it's probably the easiest to do. It's been shown that the hotter a food is, the less bitter it tastes, like with vegetables or coffee. Also, the hotter the food, the sweeter it tastes. You may not realize how sweet ice cream really is because it's usually eaten cold. But warm it up in the microwave and drink that extra sweet cream. Artichokes contain a chemical called cinnarin which stick to your sweet taste buds. But artichokes don't taste sweet because your taste buds basically ignore it. However, when you drink water to wash the artichoke down, the water removes the cinnamon from your tongue, which makes the brain think that something sweet had been there all along. This should make the water you drink after eating artichokes taste like a sweet fruit juice. <sighs> Gymnema sylvester is an herb that blocks your sweet taste receptors. This means that sugar can't stick to those taste receptors, so you can't taste anything sweet. The effect lasts for about half an hour until the herb wears off, so if you're tired of how yummy and sweet candy is, Eat it with some Gymnema Sylvester and enjoy the nothingness of candy when it's not sweet. That's a bad example. Sterubin is a chemical found in Yerba Santa, a plant native to California. It blocks your bitter taste receptors, erasing any bitter taste in foods. Perhaps sprinkle some on veggies to make them taste like nothing. But hey, I'd, I'd say that's at least an improvement, right? Or perhaps a bit more important than being a veggie masker, it's actually currently being studied as a possible treatment for Alzheimer's disease. My personal favorite, Miracle Fruit, has a protein called Miraculin that'll make sour things taste sweet. It works by first sticking to your sweet taste receptors and then grabbing anything sour that you eat and telling your brain it's actually sweet. Basically making sour things taste sweet. The effect also lasts for about half an hour. So to demonstrate, here's a sour lemon. And this is me eating it before Miraculin. Oh. Now I'll chew a Miracle Berry. And here's me eating it after. Ooh. So keep hacking taste buds, keep asking questions, and keep on squinting. So those are some good ways to make bad things taste like nothing or good things taste better. But do you want a way to make life taste better? Subscribe to the channel and click the little bell down below to make sure you're in the know whenever we post new videos. Now that's sweet.